So we're going to move on to the lumber technique, which uh, which is a common technique that I find myself using a lot in practice. So uh, good for your lower back pain patients, lower back stiffness, and uh, also sacroiliac joint issues. Before we do this, we're going to have a look at range of movement in the lumbar pelvic region. We're going to have a look at lumbar spine flexion, extension, having a good look at how that client's moving, side flexion left and right, comparing the sides. From there, we can also have a look at the passive straight leg raise again to see is there a difference between left and right leg and are they limited by their lower back. And in this case, we're using the bed. So we're having our client go into a four point kneeling in child's pose stretch. Again, many clients are gonna have some uh, back pain and discomfort. They may not tolerate forward flexion in standing. So this is a good position to do it from. As always, measure and cut your tape across the given area indicated here. So from the PSIS till around the thoracolumbar junction. First thing we're going to do is tear the base away and pop this just in line with the PSIS region. Once they're in a stretch, we're going to lay the two tails down along the erector spinae muscle with 0% stretch. So just nice and neutral. Uh, you can use thicker strips, so you could use two eye strips if you have a bigger client. Then we're going to return them back up to neutral. At this point, we're going to use an eye strip to do a stretch technique. Okay, it may be helpful to prior mark the pinpoint area of pain. So for example, here, we're going to do a nice 50% stretch over L4-5 region, okay, so a common area of pain. And you can use more than one strip, and there you have it.